So, the last video should have given you guys a pretty good idea of what I've been up to for the last three years since 2007 and what I hope to accomplish in 2010 with uh, setting up the two math websites, right? And what I hope to really have available online indefinitely as long as we have unbiased, unfiltered access to the internet, open access to the internet. Now, what I'm looking for is basically any content that complements what I've done already. Uh, specifically music, 100% music, because I really do want to uh, cut the videos to music. Uh, if there's any animation that anyone thinks will complement the stuff that I've done or, you know, be layered on top of anything that I'm doing. Um, I know when I was growing up, uh, one, of the, one of the best things that I ever came across was uh, the, the animation that was available on Sesame Street, old school Sesame Street. Yeah, I, used to, um, I used to be mesmerized by the, uh, by the animations with the little characters running around, right? I learned a lot from that. So if anybody's out there uh, that thinks they can do animation and they're willing to join this project, then uh, for sure send it my way. Music 100%. Any other content, if, you're, you, know, if you think you can do uh, skits, if you can do lessons even, because what I've done uh, since 2007, especially for the first series, I sort of did only one run through it because uh, I was trying to provide information, I was trying to provide lessons uh, for my relative that was in the United States. So I only had, uh, I was only able to do one filter run through it. So I know there's uh, some gaps in there where I have to connect some ideas, right? And I'm going to go back and hopefully create videos for those. But if anybody finds any gaps that are present right now in series one, two, or three, uh, then, you know, if you think you can fill that gap, for sure, it'd be fantastic. So basically, I'm looking for any content that complements what I've done so far. And even, even if you don't, if you're not willing to, you know, join this project, just keep this in mind that the internet is here to stay, hopefully it's here to stay. And this is really, you know, the, the best way I can, I can describe it is the age of creation, it's the age of sharing. Uh, anything that you want to create, any lessons that you can create and share with anyone, because the internet is available, you know, across the globe, or it will be available across the globe, then, you know, whatever you provide online is going to be available long after you're gone, long after I'm gone. And that's my plan, right? Everything that I'm creating hopefully will, will be available to anybody that wants to learn mathematics long after I'm gone, long after you're gone, you know, 20 years from now, 50 years from now, 100 years from now, 1,000 years from now, if we're still around, right? Uh, people will need to learn mathematics. And anything we provide right now is uh, online, open access, free access to anyone that wants to learn any material will hopefully be a legacy to a certain degree of who we were and what we were able to create. So for anyone that's willing to join this project, the only thing that I can promise is that credit will be given what credit is due. So, you know, links will be provided on both websites to your website, uh, names, the creators list, there'll be, you know, everything will be referenced, just exactly the same way I've done all the videos so far, right? You know, the names of the, mu the, name, name of the music, the people pro uh, creating it, and links to the websites and uh, the creators, right? What I'm hoping to do is do a revenue sharing scheme based on the, the time frame of the content that I'm going to end up using to put the final package together. Okay, So if there is you know, two hours of content and you're providing five minutes of that two hours, then it would be five divided by 120 minutes, right? Five minutes divided by 120 minutes. There's 120 minutes in two hours, right? So that percentage of the revenue that we take in uh, you know, less our overhead will be directed towards whoever the creators are. Okay, so if we if we think about it, we have you know, let's, have, let's say we got 1.5 hours worth of uh, you know their, uh, worth of material on a DVD, right? Now on top of this, there's going to be music and maybe animation or anything else that can be layered on top of this, right? So for example, we would have you know, batches, batches of music layered on top of this. Can you even see that? Let's make that bigger. You know, there'll be music layered on top of this, and maybe, 
you know, animation or anything else, right? So let's say total, there'll be 1.5 hours, you know, video content available on DVD. And then there's another half an hour of different types of stuff layered on top of this, right? So total would maybe have two hours of material, right? So let's say we have two hours of content. Okay, so if you have, if we have five minutes, if someone's provided five minutes of content, it would be five divided by two hours or 120 minutes. Now, the content, the, the lessons, all of this may not be my, my content that I've created so far. It could be, you know, content, some, some content from other people, right? Any gaps that, have, that, are, that are right now present in any of the series that I've done, okay? So that's basically the percentage of revenue sharing we're talking about, or I'm hopefully trying to, uh, you know, create this, basically the business model we're talking about. So, so for example, if we were selling a DVD, a two hour DVD for $20. So if we're selling a two hour DVD for $20, and this, this model could be uh, taken down to, uh, you know, individual videos or batches of videos, because I don't plan on just selling DVDs. I plan on putting batches of DVDs, uh, batches of videos together and selling them on you know iTunes or any other portals that are available that have that you can sell content on right so generating revenue not just from selling DVDs but also individual videos or batches of vid videos groups of videos depending on the content right it could be exponents all the all the videos related to exponents sold as a batch on iTunes or any other portal for $20. Right? So this, from this we would hopefully you know, have less five dollars because you know we need support. We need whatever the whatever the content is, right? Whatever the price tag is. So if there's fifteen dollars left over from the sale of the DVD, then the percent, whatever, uh, whatever the time frame, the percent that you've created, the percent f uh, from that fifteen dollars, the percent will go towards whoever's contributing to this project. Okay. Now, I don't just plan on doing DVDs and just selling the videos as batches to individuals. We can also put uh, packages together for institutions and uh, you know expand it from there and maybe uh, we'll mo most definitely create uh, booklets, exercise booklets um, with solutions and possibly videos for the exercises for examples. Okay, So this thing is, I plan on making this project fairly large. I plan on doing this for a long time and uh, like I said before, providing enough content to basically for, for anyone that wants to learn mathematics uh, from the basics, which is you know uh, the real number set, all the way up to calculus or statistics can sit down and go through the material and learn this content, right? And you know, hopefully we can provide support for this as well, uh, including forums and you know, bring on some people that can you know, answer questions that people might have. Okay, so basically, what we're, what I'm trying to do right now, in 2010, is do the base work, set up the two websites, the personal site and the site that's going to generate uh, uh, revenue for organizations that are trying to end prohibition, and these go together. Okay, so if anybody is wants to provide content, wants to join this project, you must understand and you must agree with what I'm trying to do, which is generate revenue on a personal level, right? And also generate revenue for these organizations. I'm not interested in separating these two projects, okay? Or anybody providing content. If you don't agree, if you're, you know, if you agree with the war on drugs, which I am 100% against, um, you know, if you want to join this project just on a personal level, I'm sorry, I can't, um, you know, I, I'm not going to uh, be interested in that work because I don't, for one reason is, I don't want to create two sets of, two sets of videos, two sets of packages, uh, because that doubles my work. The other reason is, is one of the main reasons that I'm doing this is to generate money for these organizations, okay? So you must agree to that. Now, that's how we're going to generate revenue on the first phase of things, right? Uh, there are other stages that I plan on implementing later on, but this is going to keep me occupied long enough and hopefully keep you occupied long enough if you're interested in joining this, right?